guess I'll go ahead and start and then this will be downloaded for later and someone can watch it if they want to. I, um, I hope that everyone's open to him on hearing his message because I'm sure it'll be a good one. <clears throat> he is always the hippie master on top of the mountain, at the top of the waterfall with his dreadlocks, just meditating and being chill. So... Let's see what he wants to share with us today. <clears throat> he wouldn't give me any heads up, so. I'm Shiva, the divine masculine. You can find me in the wilderness, beneath the trees, in the vines, in the cave, and atop of the mountain. Always with the intention of balance and harmony. For as a divine masculine, I must tell you that everyone has a divine masculine in them. Yes, even the females, you have access to both energies. It is what creates your yin and your yang, your balance and your alignment. If you are not connected with your masculine, you may feel like People could be taking advantage of you. You could be feeling like your voice is being unheard. It could be that you're unsure of speaking your truth. You may feel like the divine masculine within you is a darkness, a shadow, but no, it is not. It is part of your divinity as well as your divine feminine energy is part of your divinity. Ignoring your masculine energy can bring you off balance. I am here to share with you today the importance of the connection with the divine masculine as part of your life purpose and your life journey. You have that saying, peace, love, but take no shit. And that is the divine masculine in that. Know when it is time to stand up and speak your truth and rally for others. It is that divine masculine that is part of the support that you have for those. It is your defense. It is your energy to protect as well. And do not look at it as a shadow, but yet embrace this part of you and begin to grow and be comfortable with it. For within the balance, you may have extremes. You may be overindulgent in areas with food, with life, with material items. Or if you go the wrong direction, no, it's not the wrong direction. If you go the other direction, you may find yourself lacking. You may find yourself feeling without or less than. And so I'm here to remind you to connect with both the energies that are available to you, to find your 
balance, to find your center. It will be different for everyone. You may only need a small amount of the masculine, or you may need a large handful. Everyone is different. Yes, you are a warrior with your feminine energy. But also combine your masculine with your warrior goddess. It is okay. It is safe. It is part of your strength, your knowing, your journey. Do not fear the divine masculine. Connect with both to find your balance, your harmony. And that is my message today. It is straight. It is simple. It is for all. helpful but I know that it is it's a message that we need to hear I'm so thankful that I allowed that because I've been hesitant you know just unsure of what the message would be or why but it's a beautiful message I'm certainly thankful that I was able to let him flow in me and share that message oh hmm Love you all. Love and light. Namaste.